Should I invite him? I'm having a housewarming party on Friday. It's like 15 my friends. Do I invite him? It's like a pregame. International? He's not international. True. Okay, let's see. Maybe I'll do a like I'll try to go on a date with him during the week and then I'll see. So like the thing with me is um I am a big like inviter and like I invite people to everything. Like I always I'm very inclusive and I always invite people to stuff. And my friends like whenever I've invited to like a hinge guy to something like it's always like after like one day and I always am like you should come hang out with my friends mainly because I used to just not trust my own judge of character and I wanted my friends to like validate me that this person was normal and cute um but they always make fun of me for it and they're like you can't you stop inviting random people to, <laughs> to hang out because it's weird if you invite a random hinge person to come hang out with our group of friends it shows that you like literally want to be their girlfriend immediately and I always do that, but with him, I'm like kind of nervous. And like, I don't know. Whoa. Uh, yeah, I don't know <laughs> that like apartment. Yeah, I think I just need to wait, but like I want, part of me like wants him to come and I want my friends to meet him, but a part of me is like, yeah, maybe my gut just like really wants me to take this really slow. I don't know. Ask him to meet up, like, I don't really, I don't know. This one time, don't be an inviter. I know. I guess it wouldn't imply anything actually because my friend is sleeping on my couch this weekend because she's coming in from my housewarming. So like, I wouldn't feel, I don't know. But he's also so respectful. Like I feel like he wouldn't, I don't know. Maybe he wouldn't take it that way. We're going out after the house for me. Yeah, it's like a pregame. I told him about it already. I was like, oh, like, because we were talking about our like plans for the rest of the month, basically. And I was like, yeah, like on this weekend, I'm just having like my housewarming and like, that's it. And he was like laughing at me because I literally moved in months ago. <laughs> but that's all, like he didn't ask if he, he didn't say anything about inviting himself or anything. We are overthinking it. We spent five hours together today and we spent five hours together on Thursday. I think there's chemistry there. I don't, I think so. 
Yeah, true. I'm sure he's gonna ask me what I'm doing. And he said he might have a friend visiting him this weekend too, which could be fun if he like brought his friend to like meet my friends. Um, he goes to Philly for work every week for like two nights a week. But yeah, he texted me. He texted me a picture of his um the stuff he got at the grocery store that I dropped him off at. And he was like, the meal is prepped. And I said, whoa, it's giving chef. Yeah, he's like, he's Oh, right, that's what I was looking up. I was looking um, his birthday. <laughs> Let's see if we can find out his birthday. The only social media he has is Facebook and it's from like literally forever ago. He says he doesn't even know when he last was on it. So I'm hoping I can find his birthday on it. Oh my God, his profile picture from is from college. He looks, oh my God, these pictures are so old. He's like, a baby. Wow. Oh my god, he was cute. Okay, sorry. I have three mutual friends with him. Where is his birthday? I really don't want to accidentally click add friend. Okay. January 19th. Is he a Capricorn? Report, okay, Capricorn, Libra, mix. How is that? His dating profiles are green flag. My brother and my dad are both Capricorns. Wow. I'm gonna Google Libra Capricorn. No, it's okay, Mariah. I was actually wondering about that. I was gonna text you, but literally no rush. Her. <laughs> I'm like looking at all the, um... wait, I'm gonna go on my, uh... what's the chart called? Uh... CoStar and see what it says about me with a Capricorn. Astro talk. Yeah, we talked about long-term visions in terms of like career, like where we wanna live, like, yeah. My ex was Cancer. Capricorns are hardworking, loyal, and honest. I mean, he's definitely hardworking and he's definitely honest. Also, when we were walking, um, when we were walking, so on our first date, I told you guys, one of the, one of my followers like found, like was at the bar and like started like freaking out about like seeing me. And she was like, oh my God, like, Emily, like, I can't believe I'm seeing you. And then she was like saying, um, she was like, you're gorgeous on TikTok and Instagram, but in person, like, oh my God, like you're literally stunning. And I was like, girl, thank you. You understood the assignment. And she said that in front of me. So that, that was funny. And then today, um, a like homeless man was like trying to like get us to like give him money. And we were just like kind of walking by and he was like, he was like, wow like look at you guy like you're, you're with such a beautiful girl like you're a lucky man like you better know that like you better treat her well like you're you're a lucky guy i was like laughing i was like we were both laughing and he was like wow he's quite the salesman <laughs> yeah he knows about my tiktok because i showed him i told him because of my phone case yeah he knows i do tiktok so yeah now two times we've been together and two times people have been like Oh my God, like you're stunning. And I'm like, thanks.
yeah the homeless guy also understood the assignment i was like thanks dude <laughs> we're getting sushi for dinner <laughs> 